JBWS began in 1976, determined to provide relief for others experiencing isolation, loss of control, and fear from living in a violent household. A small group of domestic violence survivors founded the organization as Jersey Battered Women's Service. Initially a grassroots organization, it began as a 24 hour hotline answered in the homes of its founders. As calls increased, the need for safety became urgent. The women survivors set their sights on opening a shelter in Morris County. They searched abandoned buildings, vacant stores and church basements looking for a possible location and applied for federal funding. This was all while sheltering victims in a volunteer's home. When the press revealed the location of the home, it had to be shut down. And with its closure, Lois Gilmore had nowhere to seek safety. Without specialized community resources, legal options or shelter, Lois was in danger. One day in 1977, her husband, along with their 18-year-old son, walked into the beauty salon where she worked. And he says, Lois, I have a gun. If you don't, uh, if you don't reconcile with me, I'm going to kill you. Her customers started screaming. The whole place was screaming. She was saying no. He fired two shots. Mom went down. And as I w watched her go down, um, I saw him run towards her out of the corner of my eye. I uh, put the gun to his head and pulled the trigger. This tragedy was soon followed by another. While JBWS was trying to raise enough funds to open the shelter, Rita Asensio tried to escape her abuser by going to stay with her mother. One day, her husband broke into the home and shot Rita and her mother in front of her children. Outraged, the community rallied and raised the necessary funding to open the shelter in 1978. It's been 45 years since the first hotline call was answered. And since then, JBWS has answered 227,000 helpline calls, sheltered or counseled 113,000 adults, and educated 487,000 teens and adults in the community about the devastating problem of domestic violence. In memory of Lois Gilmore and Rita Asensio, and in honor of all of those served in 45 years, we invite you to donate $45 so that together we can continue to save and change lives. Your gift of $45 will provide two helpline calls for a victim in crisis, one and a half hours of children's counseling, or one dating abuse prevention program for high school or middle school students. And that's just to name a few examples. To make your secure online anniversary donation, visit us at jbws.org. And for a complete list of all of our comprehensive services, and to learn how you can help, please visit our website or give us a call. And remember what Margaret Mead said, never doubt that a small group of thoughtful, committed citizens can change the world. Thank you so much for your support.